1964, a thrilling season at Georgia Tech. In the season opener, the Vanderbilt Commodores, coached by Jack Green, come to town. Captains for Tech are Johnny Gresham from Washington, Georgia, and Bill Curry of College Park, Georgia. Johnny Gresham, running inside, blasts up the middle, good for 13 yards. Priestley slides right, pitches off to Gresham. Johnny goes in for a touchdown, the clinching score of the game. Here on the ground level camera is Gresham's payoff touchdown. Georgia Tech 20, Miami nothing. Fisher sliding right, pitches back to Gresham. He sees his hole, bursts through it beautifully, and goes for a tech first down and 19 yards on the play inside the Hurricane 30. Watch this catch by Johnny Gresham, one of the fine catches of the year. A long pass from Priestley, a diving grab by Gresham at the Miami four-yard line. Placing outside right in, Gresham picks up 13 yards on the play, and Tech again moves the set. Late in the fourth quarter. Johnny Gresham breaks through the middle. Look at the speed to go. This play is good for 32 yards. Captain Jimmy Seward of Macon, Georgia, and Johnny Gresham meet with the Clemson captain before the game. Now one of the longest runs of the season. A great effort by Johnny Gresham on a pitch out from Priestley. Gresham breaks through, racing five people. Gets into the open. Will they catch him? No, sir. He goes 54 yards. Gets into the end zone for a touchdown for Georgia Tech. Georgia Tech 17, Navy nothing. Friday night, October 9th, Jacksonville, Florida. A short flare pass to Johnny Gresham. Watch little Johnny go, broom in, over people, and down the sideline for 30 yards. Fisher again takes to the air. And again he connects with Johnny Gresham. This play drifts at 13 yards to the midi 10 yards. Homecoming, Grant Field, Atlanta, as Tech plays host to the Tulane Green Wave. Johnny Gresham gets the call. Leaps over people and gains 12 yards and a Tech first down. Priestley back to pass. Curls a long one to Johnny Gresham. He's behind the defense. He's got it. This play is good for 39 yards for Georgia Tech. October 31st, Durham, North Carolina. A sellout crowd's on hand as both Duke and Georgia Tech are unbeaten. This pass down the middle picked off beautifully by Bill Curry of Georgia Tech giving the Jackets possession. Tech calls on halfback Johnny Gresham. Here he spurts outside in. And look at Gresham go. This play good for 35 yards for Tech. Here, Fisher pitches out to Gresham. This play's good for 17 yards and a tech first down. Now on a sweep to the left, Johnny Gresham with the ball, and he really carries the mail. Gresham barrels into the end zone for a touchdown, and Georgia Tech leads Tennessee 6 to nothing. Here he loops the pass, complete to Johnny Gresham. It's good for 12 yards, and Tech is threatening. Paul Bear Bryant pushes the Crimson Tide, and they have a host of captains on the field before the game. For Georgia Tech, the co-captains are Johnny Gresham and Jimmy Seward. Johnny Gresham gets the call for Tech. He drives hard for eight yards for Tech. The Jackets threaten as Priestley hits Johnny Gresham complete to the Alabama 16-yard line. Before the Jackets, they racked up seven victories in 1964, bringing to 149 wins. The total they won under coach Bobby Dodd in this, his 20th season.